best-selling book and popular movie, Nick Sheff was a beautiful boy, a beautiful boy addicted to drugs. As Doug Emblich reports, he is now someone you should know. Please join me in welcoming Nick Sheff to the podium. Nick Sheff told his recovery story at Huther Doyle's Friends for Hope breakfast this morning. I spent the next five to seven years just chasing that feeling that I got. I understand why I do things. It doesn't make me any different. You're just embarrassed because I was like, you know, I was like this amazing thing, like your special creation or something, and you don't like who I am now. Yeah, who are you, Nick? The movie Beautiful Boy is based on two books, one written by Nick's father, the other by Nick, about his addiction to meth and other drugs starting in his teens. His message now is about hope. My doctor said to me the other day, she said, um, the reason she loves working with addicts is because if you work with someone who has a regular disease, you can, you know, treat them of that disease and their life can go back to the way that it was before. But with addiction, when someone gets sober, it's not just that their life goes back to the way that it was before they started using, their life gets so much better than it ever had been. And that has completely been the case for me. I mean, I, I just feel like so lucky. Nick is encouraged to see grassroots action to fight the opioid crisis, often from parents of addicts. Part of the solution, he says, is removing the stigma of addiction. Let people know that, you know, addicts are not bad people that need to get good. They're sick people who need to get well. There still is a very strong stigma with people with addiction. You know, when I, while I was um, homeless in San Francisco, I... To addicts, Chef offers hope that a clean life is infinitely better. And to their families, he says, don't go it alone because help is out there that person that your child was like is still there in them and that loving person it, it doesn't ever go away even though it seems like it's it has nick is 37 clean for nine years married and working as a writer now i feel really grateful the fact that that it's possible to come back from it is really it's such a gift gratitude from the beautiful boy now someone you should know for the hope he offers to so many others. Doug Emblidge, 13 Wham News. Such a powerful quote he had too, that addicts are not bad people that need to get good, they are sick people who need to get well. I thought that was very powerful and an inspiring message from him. Definitely a moving story, good work there.